Hello and welcome my beautiful Pisces, my beautiful mermaids and mermen. Brenda here with your daily vibe from your guide messages for September the 21st. I apologize for being late in the day today, <coughs> excuse me, but I had so many other um, uh, appointments that I had to tend to. Um, as you know, I have a husband who's not well and so I'm the primary driver to take him to these appointments. So please forgive me for being a little bit late. And let's see what we have. Well, starting off, and also I want to tell you that when I was shuffling, getting ready, choosing the decks that I was being guided to pick today, Spirit said, pull some tarot cards. So that's why you're seeing some tarot cards with these today. And let me know how you like that, because I can keep doing that if you like it. Okay, so our first message we've got from our angels is within the next few weeks. So if you've been waiting for something to come in, uh, whether it's tests for a medical test or scholastic tests or a phone call or an interview, um, anything that you've been waiting for, a remittance check, uh, an inheritance, whatever the case is, it's different for everybody. Something will be coming in. And, you know, this is going to be rewarding for you. And it will be coming in in the next few weeks. Uh, not the next few months, the next few weeks, because we do have that card in the deck that could have came out. But this is telling me that possibly by <clears throat> the end of next month, you will receive something here or even sooner at that. The next, when I say that, I mean maximum. So expect something rewarding to come in that you've been waiting for. Now, you've got originality. You know, the universe says we need to feel lighthearted and free while trusting that our unique way of doing things is the right way. So this is all about being true to ourselves, not allowing ourselves to be determined or, or our future dictated by other people's recommendations or opinions. It's okay to learn things from people, but we should never have to change who we are to please anybody. And today's a day where you're going to shine your originality. We're all going to go out there and be our unique one fingerprint in time. So let's feel good about that. Let's go out there today, the rest of this day today, and trust that we are unique and that we need to shine and stand in our own light. Pisces, you, we are so creative. We have that ability to adapt uh, as well as be unique. So you, we can be flexible and mutable and changeable in lots of things, but we must remain who we truly are, and that is our own individual soul self. So Pisces, stand in your light. Shine bright today and tonight. Coming in next, we have Amplify Your Positive Emotions. Well, we all know what that's all about. That's all about stepping up into the power of positivity, the law of attraction, and going out there and doing what's important and that is uh that is being positive stepping out there you know this is all about uh what we send out into the universe definitely causes a ripple effect and we want it to be good we want it to be positive we you know simply staying happy and sending that happiness out from our heart is going to benefit those around us as well so how we look at our day and how we act and and that light that we shine uh pisces do that today because you're going to find that it's going to cause that beautiful ripple effect and it'll come bouncing back to us again. As we adjust our motives and attitudes, this energy flows from us in concentric circles affecting all of our desires and beliefs. And there's a chance to bring good fortune and influence to all the events in our life by throwing that out into the universe and believing that we and manifesting what we want is already on its way. Okay? So, with everything ending, with every ending comes a new beginning. Trust. We need to trust that the positive energy we radiate will attract what we wish for. So I think there's going to be a breakthrough. I do believe that, you know, we are going to see some positive energy coming towards us now. Let's see what we have for the tarot messages. Well, we have the Queen of Swords, we have the Knight of Swords, and we have the King of Wands. So very interesting. The Queen of Wands, as we know, this is all about stepping up into the power of making those changes to leave things and let things go. Uh, you know, this is about if things aren't working out in our favor, if we, if, we're, if we have been surrounded by toxic energy or relationships or in unfulfilling 
projects or jobs that, that don't uh, reward us and give us the return that we put out there for and get recognition for it. And we don't have to change. We just need to stay who we are. And, and that is standing in our own power and our own truth. So I love this Queen of Swords. She's all about letting things go. She's all about... Um, walking away from things that don't serve her you know going out there being independent being solo uh going out there on your own pisces to make these changes come about so that you're going in a new fresh direction and by closing those doors of the past we now are opening new beginnings for us to go forward <clears throat> and this is something amazing is going to happen in the next few weeks so maybe some of you are leaving a job and going to a new one or um you know you're, you're relocating from where you live because it's just not serving you uh whatever the case is pisces you're cleaning house and that's what we need to do when things uh become overwhelming we need to clean house and literally some of you may be cleaning your closets out at this time as well because you realize that you want to downscale we're going into a new season let's get rid of the old things we're not wearing or things we're not using and open that space to have a clear sight line now the knight of swords comes in and this is very fast moving energy the knight of swords can be charging in to sweep you off your feet uh you know this can this can be somebody coming in here that could be doing that for some of you but i look at it as as having to take care of business in a quick and expedient way but listening to our voice of reason when we have to do something we have to act on something very quickly we need to pay attention to what we're what we're heading into sometimes we can bump into some unexpected and unanticipated conflict around us we mustn't make a impulsive decision all right we need to be careful about what we're doing especially when it comes to signing anything any documents or legal documentation needs to be considered very carefully reading between the lines before we do that because you've heard me say that beware once the ink hits the paper it's a done and final deal but i think you're going to be a go-getter right now i think you're you are today is a day where you've felt really really good where you wanted to shine in your light and go out after what you want making command decisions that you've been thinking about doing for a long time and finally you say hey this is what i'm going to do beautiful staying focused with this king of wands <clears throat> and this this beautiful king of wands is the most focused king out there right he doesn't play around he goes after what he wants he doesn't allow things to distract him a, or other people's opinions to do that either he's staying really focused and full steam ahead and i think that's where you're going to go you're in a position of leadership right now pisces and you know and and you're going to inspire others with your enthusiasm with your originality here with your positive emotions here this is beautiful and you could also be receiving advice from someone like this king who who excels at creative solutions for you but know that pisces you are a natural born leader anyway and um often you have a great head for business or and organizing and um you know this is great allow your innovative uh you know ideas to come forth because i think you're going to accomplish things this at this time so don't be afraid you can be an entrepreneur pisces you can have your own business you can step up there and organize your own group stand up for your convictions because i'm telling you you can make a difference okay um you know this is a wonderful card that says you're nurturing things within yourself right now well my beautiful beautiful pisces this is our daily vibe from our guides i hope you liked it let me know if you like the tarot messages because i'll continue doing them if you want so take care know i send you lots of love and many blessings and i'll see you soon